What's up traders? Welcome to another C space training video. Subscribers welcome and if it's your first time viewing I do technical analysis videos on a variety of different stocks and today we're looking at Turtle Beach Corporation H E A R. So we've been watching this you know stock for you know for a while now as it's been trading in this you know descending wedge or excuse me descending channel for um, ever since the beginning of August which is great for swing traders. And you get in here long, you get in here short, and you make money each way. Um, so today excites me just because a couple of days ago I was very bearish. Even though it wasn't the bottom of this channel, it fell below it. And it just seemed like it was about to fall out and go back down here in this area between $15 and $16. So I was wrong here because the next day it went green and it's been green for three straight days. Um, and then today we have this, it's not very bearish, but it is a bearish looking candlestick for the reason being it went all the way to the top of this channel and then all the way back down even though it did wind up closing green if it had closed red i would be a little bit more excited because i did buy a put on this today um, i bought the put shortly around two o'clock or so um, as i seen this happen it kind of took off and it got to the top of this channel almost and then you had this huge amount of selling volume that created this and you're close to a shooting star um it's very it actually may be one it's just very close but it ran up and got pushed all the way down and closed red typically means this thing's going to sell back off a very high probability and it did so so i bought a put um, and you know i'm looking at a 15 minute candle just because i want to show you the volume that came in there but this is the one that i'll trade it off of because this is the hourly um, candlestick chart and you had this huge amount of volume that went up and then came right back down with mostly being a sell and a push it back to this level and then literally the next candlestick confirmed that and it took off. Um, it could have made a pretty good, I think I bought it at one, yeah, I bought it at 145. I think it got up to around 180, 185 and around this ballpark. I should have took the money and ran. I got a little greedy because I just got into a, a put that's going on. I've got four weeks or so to get out of. So I said, you know what? I'm going to let this thing ride for a, just a day or two and just see where it goes. Um, it could possibly wind up being the wrong call because uh, if you look here on the hourly this thing is in an up trim which is positive for all the bulls and that's you know it went all the way down here and i didn't really wasn't i was at work and didn't really pay attention to it i should have sold it and touched the bottom um but because it bounced however if you're looking at volume volume is a big indicator you had a huge amount of volume on this bearish candlestick and then you had a you know a huge amount of volume sell off um, it was above it was above average on this candle which is green and looks kind of indecisive but if you dive into it a little deeper um, you have your last 15 minutes here or so most of your volume came here at the end of the day which closed red so it looks like it's just basically bouncing and it's going to come back down however news could break this weekend and change the course i mean i wouldn't expect news but who knows uh, we'll have to keep a close eye on it, but yeah, right now I am in a put, hoping to take this thing back down um, to the bottom of this channel in next week or so. Um, speaking of the weekly, if you look, if you, you know, watching patterns or so, this thing turned here, then red, red, green, red, green, red, green. You would imagine that next week um, it's definitely probably going to run back up and you know the 21 area or so, but you would think that it's going to wind up closing possibly down here around 16 or 17 just by looking at the trend so we'll have to keep a close eye on it if you're interested in following along on uh you know follow along with this stock please click that subscribe button if you're interested in following any others check out the other videos and you know subscribe if you see that it adds value if you uh, got any value out of this and you think the content is um worth um, me continuing uh, simply click that like button that like button allows me you know it lets me know that the, you know, the content is valuable and if you have any questions or comments simply ask below i do not mind answering any questions and plus i got a few good traders that are subscribed and they keep eye on my comment section if you know anybody has questions if you're new don't mind asking you know any questions because we've all been there None of us is perfect. We are all trying to learn and all make money together. So guys, comment below if you've got questions. And that is going to be it. And I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And I'll check with you later.